Well, it was, a, it was a pretty bad injury. Probably 20 more minutes and I wouldn't have made it. During the game, I got hit in the side of my stomach and it turned out that I had ruptured my spleen. I was lying down and I just, I couldn't get up and I started passing out. They actually had to do an emergency surgery that night and uh, they had to remove my spleen because I lost almost like three liters of blood. They said that uh, during the surgery, because it was like a, it was a pretty long surgery, it was like a three hour surgery, that my heart rate was at like 150 the whole time just because of how, how much blood I had already lost. The doctor told me that had I not been an athlete, I probably wouldn't have made it through. Just the fact that I was in such good condition going into that and that I was pretty strong, I was able to make it because he said that probably 20 more minutes and I wouldn't have made it. It was pretty scary, but right now I'm at a point where like, I honestly don't even think about it anymore. It's not even in the back of my head. The first couple of days were really, really rough. You're playing one day, then the next day you're in the hospital, you can't move and it's just like, like what, what happened to my body? It took like almost a month and a half for me to start being able to exercise a little bit. I wasn't really scared because I've never really been scared of the ball hitting me or stuff, but it was a little bit kind of touch and go at the beginning where you don't have the same confidence as you did before the injury. My mom's a sports psychologist, so I rely on her a lot. So we talked about it a lot, kind of just getting over the injury. The beginning with, it, with the injury, I used to put like just a little protection. It was more of a mental thing and then just I kind of just got over it and I was like, this is what I love doing, I'm just going to keep doing it. I had a rough, a rough couple of years in Spain, especially the last two. I'd had two, two very serious injuries. And when this opportunity arose, I just thought it was the right moment to make a change in my life, kind of get a fresh start. It was a really good opportunity for me, so I decided to, to come here, and I'm very happy that I did. I'm not going to focus on the past and on an injury. I'm just going to keep going and keep doing what I like to do. Thank you.